I want you to remember that golf is going to give you very many opportunities in life. Hello. It will teach you manners, like how to behave in community and society. And it also humbles you down because it's not an easy game. They are going to get <laughs> bottle tops to use them like this. You don't need much. You can be creative and you can play from anywhere. Nice. Good, 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 good. I'm ready to start up something that they can play forever and ever. Okay. On the bike? Yeah, we're just gonna follow him. Okay. Where are we going, Arnold? Down. The rest, uh, the rest space. Mm. We're gonna see Roger. Every Tuesday, when I'm off, I come this side. I capture Roger's videos and then I edit them after. Okay, so here's Roger stay. So, I'm going to have breakfast, then I can go. The net is there. You want me to build it? The way I got introduced to golf is I was looking for a job October 2018. Because when my dad died, I had to, to look after my sisters and brothers. So he called me and he told me that there is a job at Serena Golf Course. You can come and try it out. So I came and trained as a caddy. When I got to see a golf course, I didn't know much what it means. You see clubs, you don't know what they mean, what they do. But through practice and watching many videos on YouTube, I was able to get used to it. Because you can't be a good caddy when you don't know how to play. So that's what inspired me to, to keep learning and learning. Then I started the Instagram thing. What's up guys, uh, this is the load drill. Slow-mo swing library. That is how I got to know Nick, through Instagram. When I saw one of his posts come into my feed, some of the most natural talent I guess I've ever seen in like my you know, four years of doing breakdowns. He told me to keep posting videos Keep doing what you're doing, like consistency. I just felt like the right thing to do was to show him how he could grow on social media and like potentially grow a business for himself. We would practice just in open space and then also bed sheets. He started noticing things about his game and noticing things about his swing, and he didn't really understand the swing. So I said that I would do a breakdown for him for free. Where your body is pointed, so you can see that it's pointed this way. And then from there, we just stayed in touch. So if you ever had a question or anything about the swing, I would answer it. So yeah, it was like all the time. Now let's just get you tilted in the right direction. He told me 
You are the first person I've told everything and you have been able to do it. He's one of my best friends at this point. We talk like almost every day. Oh yeah? And he just has a perspective on things that no one here has. Wow, that's awesome, dude. He's my friend, but sometimes he thinks like I'm like his brother. It was just like continuous friendship slash also I'm helping him understanding his swing. And that continues to this day. Arnold is a caddy, but Arnold just came. I told you you'd find him here. He lives very far, but he came very early. This one, he works with, with us. And he's a caddy. In the morning, catch up with Lodja and Martin, and then we warm up, then we get on the course ready. These are my arrows. These are ball marks. You know, that guy was learning how to hit balls, and then that's how, that's how he hit the, this wall with the balls. Here, here, here. And he's learning. They can yes. try as well. I can try. You can come and try. Don't go, you're going to It's cool because he was swinging like this all over the body, but you just need to, to make it simple. Recently, when I came here, I met these guys, they were playing here. So, I somehow got, got an interest back. I was like, let me try this thing. Since I stay with these guys, and every morning they practice. The way he swings the balls, eh? even if you're in bed, you're like, let me come back. <laughs> <laughs> These are the tea leaves. This one is like spice. Good. So this is the bread. This is my my neighborhood. Like, like there's a shortcut there I used to go to Serena. Serena is somewhere around there. That is where I walk from, just about 10 minutes. Hi, everyone. Are you good? I'm going to start with consistency. Every guest that makes their way to travel here is our ambassador. And their first point of contact is you. The area that we always get comments on is the caddies and the maintenance and the friendliness of the staff. So even as you're looking at me now, I need to smile, guys. Please, don't be so serious. <laughs> Remember the golfer that's coming behind you. That's why you guys are playing golf is to put yourself in that same position, that same spot, that you can give them the best advice. Roger here is a great example of that. What he does in his personal life reflects what he does in his workplace. Yeah, let's give him a great hand of applause. You tell us a little bit more about your background and uh, your journey up to now. Yes, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yeah. My name is Roger, Kauchi Rogers, also known as Sally Rogers. I started working with my mom in Kampala, and things were going well. Then my dad died. I stopped working in Kampala, and uh, yeah, life was not easy. Uh. Let me rest a bit. Ah, okay, now I'm back. <laughs> I became a caddy master 
Mr. Theo gave me the opportunity. Then I became a starter. That is how I am right now. The rest is, is my personal life, golf, things like that. Yeah, I'm just like the way you see me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, great. Thanks, Roger, I appreciate that. If you take where we are located yeah. on a map, yeah. it's very tough to find. Yes. <laughs> and uh, through your exposure, it really brought a lot of publicity. Yes. And, um, you know, I really believe that we will definitely see some more interest, not yes. only in people like you, yeah. but also for other juniors as well. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. That's it. Thank you guys. You All must right. have a great afternoon. Naturally, he comes through quietly. <laughs> yeah. But the moment you see him interact with other uh, caddies, then you can see it coming out. <laughs> he was always somebody that they would listen to and follow his lead. Another hole, we pick another hole. Go in! Oh. <laughs> Roger is a nice guy, self taught, self motivated, and he has inspired most of us here. Most of Cadiz here now have started to play golf. This one, guys, okay. swing past mine. <laughs> Show me. Soko J. He's definitely got a bunch of guys that feeds <laughs> off his energy. The way that they interact actually every single day, they're like a bunch of brothers. You see, he has a very big smile. I told you. <laughs> I give Cadiz tips. I like Cadiz to play golf. I like very many people to play golf. I think I just like to teach. Kenny, the one for the back swing. Yeah, like this. Hey. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Do it slow. That's basically my dream, to be a teaching pro. Then I can be able to share tips and keep introducing golf to many people. Golf is a very good game. It has changed my life a lot. And I believe it can change many people's lives. Jangu, so koji. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it's their first time, all of them, to, to see a golf club. So I think, I don't know what they feel in their mind. I think they are happy. Yeah. When you see me, you will come and hit balls anytime you see me, okay? Yes. All right. That's good. Over here. If I beat, I win. He means that if he hits the ball up, he wins because most times I give them a challenge. You are able to raise the ball up, you take like 1,000 Ugandan shillings. So that's why he came. Torture, torture, torture coming. Thank <laughs> you.
Nice. Hey, say what? 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 The teachers, if the boy it is there, do like this. <laughs> you know what a golf course is? This whole thing is just for practice, but the real thing uh, is a, a course, like where we play from. You want to go to the golf course? Yes. Thank you. You're welcome. I'll take your brother with you. This guy likes to he wants to hang around. Imagine if these kids start at this age to play golf, they will be like the Tiger Woods, the Colin Murray Cowers of this world. <laughs>